it has another hero to worry about, like Lich. Obviously, the brew's not going to do as well. Do they just choose to sacrifice a safe lane, or do they put him on bottom? Tango's, couple of sentries, he's doing alright. This constant denial from top lane is going to make a massive effort, like impact, I think. Yeah, you actually can't control the lane yeah. against Lich. It's impossible. You, like, like, look you have look, look, he, he constantly has a creep wave under his tower. He is so safe to farm. Yeah. This is the whole point of Lich, man. Yeah. You just get free farm. No matter what. And I missed first blood T-Tours. T-Tours! Whatever. They were tower diving. I didn't notice. Team Regeneration Rune and Night Stalker. Let's come for a bit of a wrap round oh. here on the bottom. Yeah, they're going, going on for fly. Yeah, they got the void on them already. There's no poison, though. He's trying to go for the body blocks. He misses a tiny bit, but he's still dead. Yeah. Decent. Good kill. Plane, because there's... A Lich constantly blasting him. He's actually farming on equal terms with Miracle right now. So it's 18 and 2 versus 18 and 1. And the Lich That's denies insane. actually don't count as denies. I missed the other one. Damn. Look to try and help find a kill onto the Anti Mage. Maybe we'll see a rotation from Rim Ranger mid lane though. Got yeah. nice going in. Big Daddy is he going to throw out the roar. There is a DD on Excalibur. He's got a shackle available. Is Ooh. he going to be able to catch up though? Beastmaster is still quite fast. In the meantime, Spartan's looks like bottom lane there Spartan's is a another four dive. Could be in trouble. Uh, I don't know. I think Milan's going to be dying here at the same time. Kills happening all over the map. Big Daddy though ends up living and yep. takes out the Night Stalker behind the tier one tower. I feel it all kind of depends on how much they can do with this Lich and... and exactly. Was, what, is he just going to continue to sit here? I'm waiting to see if he's going to go elsewhere on the map, or is someone else going to come up top, maybe look to try and help find a kill onto the Anti-Mage? Maybe we'll see a rotation from Rim Ranger mid lane, though. So, yeah. Nice sort of going in. Big Daddy, he's going to throw out the Roar. There is a DD on Excalibur. He's got a Shackle available. Is he going to be able to catch up, though? These guys are still quite fast. In the meantime, looks Spartan's like bottom lane, there is Spartan's a huge four. dive. He could be in trouble. Uh, I don't know. I think Milan's going to be dying here at the same time. Kills happening all over the map. Big Daddy, though, ends up living and yep. takes out the Night Stalker behind the tier 1 tower. He spawned another boar yeah. when it was happening in rings. He's got a point in the spell shield here. Oh, bottom lane looks like Spartan's gonna spot out fly. Just casually oh. standing there. Spider's that coming is. in. He drops Tombstone. They have a grave as well. Yeah, I think he'll be okay. Uh, maybe not, actually. Look at these spiders, guys. So well. no, I don't think the spiders care about grave. I think this guy is dead. Yeah. Oh, he killed, he killed. He's gonna casually throw out a void. But didn't kill He's still him. dead, though. <laughs> All uh, right. Nope, dead, I almost called him No Daddy. Oh. Big Daddy gets the roar right in the face. Fritz here as well. Ditura is going to be going down. No Grave this time. The Snowball for the bonus kill. Milan stuck in the shards. That's beautiful. See you later. Really nice play there for Monkey Business. You know, realizing as soon as the aggression was put on, you know, click for rotation. But they're going to be aware that he's left the mid lane straight away. During the daytime, it's very unlikely for Night Stalker to go. And uh, looks like we're about to see the reaction in the roar. So many spiders. Yeah, here it comes. He didn't get his wind run off. I think he's just dead. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god. Having Necro 2 with 10 minutes does so much. Damage. I, I think this tower is. Yeah, he's out. And they want to go on top, maybe. All right, Miracle holding his blink, very nice. But he's still very slow. Radiant he's gonna eat a lot more auto attacks. He's dead. Yeah, see ya. Oh, smart rotation there from from us. getting himself out of harm's way. Yeah. You literally it's... roar and MLG the whole team will die. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 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 he has the ages separated though. Right now. Oh, okay. Big Daddy's gonna get caught out in the river as well. There's a double damage here on Spartan. Looks like the first kill they're gonna be going for is on Big Daddy. In the meantime, though, Excalibur getting chased down. Big Daddy does not end up going down to anything but the Burning Spear will respawn with that Aegis. The rest of NLG are in the area, but the longer they stay, this is probably not gonna end well for them. Moon's gonna be the first one to go down. Date Rock, very low here, looking for the Arma Toggle. Nikwa's gonna go ahead and pop the mech. Big Daddy's still in the area. Necro still on cooldown. Yeah, the cool book cooldown for 18 seconds. Throws out a defensive roar. Damn. And a shard to follow. And it looks like Lucky Business are going to be content to just back off. And it would have been a lot better for him. But we are going to see a smoke here. <laughs> Big Daddy coming in from the back. Does have roar available. Oh, boy. He's got that book three. Is he going to be able to pop the wind run? Very quick reaction time. He is going to get stunned. Okay, Power Rangers coming in top lane. Excalibur is going to go down. Tombstone is dropped. Looks like they're trying to focus it down a little bit, but it's not dying quite fast enough. Spartan, he's going to get a grave. Snowball to the face. Punch on Tanikwa. Takes almost no damage. Pops the mech. Spartan's going to be able to walk this one off. He was taking a lot of damage. Yeah, Wild Axes come in. They do a little bit as well. And... Another Necro book popped and no objective taken here from He Boy, drops his gem. He he's drops his gem for the inventory room. Aegira has a Shadow Blade, so that means if they walk away, they're not going to have any protection for him. Oh my god. They have got the Necro. Both the three, Sigil and the Hall oh, and the Tombstone. On the Spartan, they're going on the Night Stalker straight away. Shackle is going to latch to one of the Necro minions. Big Daddy and a little bit of trouble. Shards actually block the team off a little bit. Fly unable to really get in for a good Tombstone position. The Chain Frost from NLG bouncing all over the place. Right now it's two down on the side of Monkey Business. Make that a two for two. As the Dazzle and the Night Stalker both dropped here. Fly now in the fray. He's able to get off a Decay and pops one at the same time. Now Excalibur stuck from another Ice Shards. The punch on Tanikwa and it looks like Monkey Business will be able to clean this up 
and they end up trading a full team wipe for their anti mage and a beastmaster. Okay, wh why did they fight into a Roshan when they had a tombstone assembly that's burning space with much too much for the Mir uh, Miracle Land mage to deal with? They did find two big key kills that just, yeah. The end of the day, the fight was not great. Spartan is just kind of tanking the force. Fine. Um, do you think that Lich was meant to be played in the off? Oh, oh did not know that was a smoke. Big Daddy, he's trying to walk it off. He's got that haste rune. It's going to help him out. That was pretty ballsy. The Necrominion trying to chase down Spartan here. Focus Fire is going to take it out, and that's a... Oh, Date Ra, he is being surrounded by spiders. Sentry is going to be dropped, and Big Daddy comes back in with the gem. Another chain cross being popped. This time, it is not Aghanims, unfortunately. They might be able to kill him, but that soul rip heals him for like half his HP. He's walking back up the hill. The dazzle healing wave, though, just destroys him. And now, Big Daddy coming back in here with the Tusk Punch. Antonico Gray is going to keep him alive for a little bit longer. Going to see a teleport out from the dazzle, and another shackle coming out this time between Crit and Moon Meander. But they do lose two heroes there. One of which being Ditya one of their highest net worth, and take control of the jungle. Like you're content with the way the game's going right now? Yeah, I think so. What's Mum Mumian got at the moment on the spider? You get the orchid. orchid. Ah, yeah. you get the be okay. I just clicked on him a second ago. Come oh, on. Sorry. Your mic's in the way, Andy. Sorry. Oh yeah, that's I true. See. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Oh, go bottom lane, Andy. Oh, yeah, Nikwa. Uh, he is. Oh, okay. The ice shard's actually blocking out Big Daddy and the Necro Creeps, but they do get Spartan in the meantime. The mana brings going the way of monkey business. Yeah. Uh, this isn't great because the pushing power of monkey business is pretty damn strong with the necro book still out. Yep. That base could be in a little this bit of a This is like a swarm of death. Yeah. Like Caliber was trying to focus fire down one of the necro Does he power drop the necro I mean, he needs to be careful about the damage that he's going to take and Moon Did is... Did he be needs to be careful as well. He does have the shadow grave. Yeah, but there's a gem on the Beastmaster. He blinks in, he's going to get seen. Okay, he's stuck here inside the ice shards. Good Shackle though coming out from Excalibur, he's taking quite a bit of damage, they're gonna use the Lotus Sword, but it's quite a bit like the Mana Void, taking Excalibur down to almost no health, Dick you Rob pretty much in the same boat, they are gonna get a Void off onto Miracle, looks like they will eventually lose the Husker in the process, and now Moon, Insatiable Hunger Pop, they wanna go for either a kill or Rax, they think the choice is hit Spartan a few times, maybe taken down with the damage from the Orchid, another Shackle though coming in from Excalibur between Miracle and Moon, it's gonna force them back for the time being, Lich is back alive, has Aghanim's Chain Frost at the ready. The weave is trying to pick up the dog, he's trying to go back. Yeah, and Mira. He's kind of wandering around here. Oh. Okay, Big Daddy going in, throws out the roar, pops the book, he's just going for the one and done. The lawn not going to be able to live through the stun duration. Two he stones drop. Yeah, Date Your Rot losing pretty much all of his mana, not even going to be able to cast Inner Vitality on himself anymore. And the swarm of spiders coming up the high ground. Big Daddy going in, throwing out more axes here. Nico is going to get trapped by the shards, doesn't deal damage in the chain. Comes out, BKB is popped here by Moon, just goes straight for the range max. They do not have a glyph right now, so this is a little bit troublesome. Radiant Still down Dazzle. And uh, top lane in the meantime, looks like Miracle was able to secure the tier 3, so even with them going in, they are still not able to find a kill of their own. They're getting pressured from multiple angles, and MLG seem to be in a little bit of trouble. Yeah, for sure. A Miracle with that butterfly now, looking to Ooh. even... He's have a solar crest on top of that as well. Oh, God. Uh, he is uh, gonna get offensively woven. Oh jeez, this is gonna be such a hard defense for energy. Ah, the shackle shot's not gonna connect. Oh, go. he goes right in. He just wants to go for the you off. He's gonna be forced to pop a shadow blade. Focus fires cast a miracle. Pops a man style. Goes back in. He does have mana void, but probably doesn't want to use it on just a husker in the back line. Spartan. He's gonna get annihilated. Another shackle comes in onto miracle. He does still have that aegis. And the lotus oh, is gonna reflect the chain frost, but it's not really gonna do much damage. Only bounces to Excalibur. And the good game, well played, comes out. 18 kill lead at the 33 minute mark, and the monkey dream. business. End the, the run of NLG the... here. The Frankfurt Open. That but it mathematically eliminates them from the running. <laughs> Alright.